Jingle Bells and Jolly Rogers. In the heart of the Caribbean Sea, the pirate ship Mary Marauder sailed under the command of the notorious Captain Holly. Despite her fearsome reputation, Captain Holly was known for one peculiar trait. She never celebrated Christmas. Her crew, a band of merry pirates who loved the holiday season, found this utterly baffling. One day, as the chill of December brushed against the salty sea air, the crew hatched a plan. This year, declared first mate Jingles, we're going to give Captain Holly the grandest Christmas she's ever seen. The crew whispered excitedly among themselves, envisioning a holiday so spectacular that even their stern captain would be moved. The pirates embarked on a quest to gather decorations and gifts. They sailed to hidden coves and distant ports, bartering and sometimes borrowing what they needed. The ship's cook, Old Salty, even concocted a special Christmas feast plan, featuring exotic spices and recipes from the farthest reaches of the seas. As Christmas Eve approached, the Merry Marauder was transformed. Glittering lights adorned the masts and garlands twisted around the cannons. A grand Christmas tree, taken from a snowy island, stood proudly on the deck, decorated with shiny trinkets and baubles. The pirates had even crafted a makeshift Santa suit, though who would wear it was still a matter of hot debate. On the eve of their grand celebration, a storm hit. The sea roared and the ship rocked violently threatening to undo all their preparations. Captain Holly, at the helm, steered them expertly through the tempest. The crew worked tirelessly, securing the decorations and protecting the festive feast from the fury of the ocean. As dawn broke on Christmas Day, the storm subsided. The crew, exhausted but determined, set the final touches to their surprise. Captain Holly emerged from her cabin, her eyes widening in disbelief at the sight that greeted her. The ship was a spectacle of Christmas joy, a stark contrast to the usual sternness of pirate life. The crew, led by first mate Jingles in the Santa suit, burst into a hearty rendition of a Christmas shanty. Old Salty presented the feast, a spread that tantalised even the toughest of pirate palates. Captain Holly, for the first time in years, cracked a smile, her eyes twinkling with unspoken emotion. As they sat down to eat, the crew shared stories of Christmases past, tales of lands far away and adventures long gone. Captain Holly listened, her stern facade melting away in the warmth of her crew's camaraderie. Finally, Captain Holly stood up, raising her glass. To my crew, she said, her voice steady but soft, for showing me the true spirit of Christmas. May our sails always catch the wind, and our hearts always catch the joy of this season. The pirates cheered, clinking glasses in a celebration that would be remembered for many Christmases to come. That Christmas on the Merry Marauder wasn't just about the lights, the gifts, or the feast. It was about a family of pirates who came together to share the joy of the season, and in doing so, brought a new light into the heart of their captain. And from that year forward, Christmas became a cherished tradition aboard the Merry Marauder, a symbol of unity and joy amidst their roguish life at sea.